everybody. So a few days ago I bought a, a sled. Um, I've started incorporating sled pulls into my workouts and surprisingly um, great results. So the main thing I got it for was um, sore left knee. Not that sore but enough to niggle the pain to make you think twice about having a workout. So I just bought a little one off of um, eBay. <coughs> One you can just stack weights onto, um, and um, just put some carpet down. I'm going to get some more carpet actually because I quite like it. And, um, and I'm just going to stick this tripod on the, on the weight stack. So I just put a, just a belt on it. Came with a harness. All I'm doing is I'm pulling back. You can see the resistance. And it's really helping my quads. And it's really helping my knees get work on. It's really having a good effect. I've only been doing it a few days. And pain in my left knee is nearly gone. No idea to spook around. Spin it around, have another run. So, yeah, and then I'm going to go in and do some um, some trap bar deadlifts. Really feel that in the legs, and it's really good. One workout for sure. Um, <coughs> nine kilos of Okay, so um, after doing some sled pulling, I slowly went up in weight. I warmed up my, my knees now, so I'm going to do some uh, trap bar deadlifts just to change it up a bit. So, another thing too, I'm using a, a different camera. It's a, it's an Acaso Brave uh, 7LE, so I'm not sure how the sound's going to go, but um, it's a good opportunity to try it on making another video. Let's see if we can pick things up. Not sure how the light's going to go. <coughs> so I've only got um, 50 kilos on here at the moment, plus that weighs about. 20, 23 kilos, actually trap up. But the good thing is you're not going to hit your knees, your shins on these because you've got plenty of room and and you're picking up from a higher height so you haven't got so much back work involved. So that's a good warm up weight. another 20 on each side <coughs> it's supposed to be winter here but it's quite warm in the shed again and I don't want to put the fan on because the uh, camera might not like it but I might put the 
I used to yell. Brown noise. Chalk next time. So I'll be sixty five kilos each side, <coughs> plus twenty three for the bar. Could be twenty five. Still a heavy weight. Oh, okay. So 130, 153 roughly kilos. <coughs> 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 A bit of a rest and see what else we can get up to. So I managed to fit a <clears throat> that's 15 kilo on each side, so that'll be 183. See how many reps I can get out of that. One would be good. Oh dear. reps that's pretty good. I like to try a little bit heavier but don't have much room. I would like to try put a little well, 10 on each side just to see if I can bunch it shock the muscles. But I'll uh, I'll have to use spring clip. I'm going to try and work this out when I get back to you. This will be uh, I managed to get a 10 on each side no clip so Hopefully the last weights won't fall. This will be uh, 203. So I can normally do this on a straight bar, but I haven't done it on a trap bar. So let's see. I got one, never mind. I'll put the weight back on. I gotta do one more. Can't just do one. the same one again, never mind. Anyway, knees feel really good, strong. Um, so the sled really works. Um, you don't have to go buy a sled, you can make one. A bit of wood, put some weights on it, a bit of rope, drag it down the driveway. I just got concrete, stamped concrete, so if I had to put some carpet down, I thought I might as well, for like 45 bucks <laughs> if you buy a sled, you know, that's pretty cheap and um, gives it a good benefit. It's a good warm up before you come into your gym. It's a good bit of cardio too if you if you um, pull it fast. Because when you when you got that 90 kilos on it, it's quite hard to pull it even on the carpet. Um, so I'm gonna get some longer strips of carpet, <coughs> just old carpet, 
so I can make one long runway. So it'll be about, I don't know, maybe, maybe almost 20 metre run, or no, 15 metre run, which would be really good. Helps you, it really helps you, your quads too. Build up your quads. Same with this, this builds up your quads. For me, bad genetics, little quads, but they're just muscle. No fat. But I can still lift, as you can see. So don't worry about having the size, it's just the, the way you train your muscles to get that strength. Anyway, um, I'll wrap it up for today. It's getting a bit warm. And um, I'll catch you on the next one, guys. Have a good week and uh, over and out.